till I see and then I can discern. Because remember, God gives you enough for just every day. You don't have to worry about tomorrow in God's kingdom, just today. So today, we're going to we're gonna get you through today with your hope and your faith intact because faith is a mustard seed, moves a mountain. God is moving this mountain. That's why I fast and pray every day. Now I'm going to go get the other summaries. Um, let me see what everybody else is saying because I believe that there's strength in numbers. Everybody's got different intel people. Nobody could have all the best sources, but I think I do have the best sources because they're right there. And I trust them, right? Mountain goat. If you step outside of Iraq, when they finally do reinstate the dinar, the exchange of the three zero notes will exchange whatever currency exchanges, i.e. Forex rate is at the time at that time. Caperoni. Monetary policy in any country is never a random or act or arbitrary. Just as, as I just said, they've been planning this for a year, years. It's a result of progress. Until Iraq passes the needed legislation to encourage investment, the dinar will continue to remain moot. That's his opinion. I don't believe I, they ju I just. I just what I said is in direct contradiction to that because they've given the CBI control over their monetary policy. OK, if the if the central bank wants us to move forward and the money to start flowing and those contracts to go forward and to earn money, the central bank of Iraq wants to earn money, then they will decide when this happens. And they want those memorandums of understanding to turn into working dollars. I can guarantee you or they would have never done those intentions. Those memorandums of understanding have an expiration expiration date. Nobody asks about that, right? This has to happen for those to be active. Otherwise, all the work he did by coming to the U.S. is for naught. Do you think that was a wasted trip? 